Hi, this is Mansi Mehta, founder of Cancer Mitra. Cancer Mitra is a patient-centric community platform focused on end-to-end -end cancer care solutions. Uh, for the last one, one and a half year, we have been helping patients in India, Middle East, Bangladesh, uh, and um, uh, Africa to seek end-to-end uh, -end support uh, in their journey with cancer, especially for delivery in India. So we are more so a centralized platform for consult and advice and anything a patient would require in their journey. And we have a decentralized network of partners uh, where uh, we kind of provide smart solutions to our patients to find accessible, affordable care. Well, so whilst we started thinking of a digital platform, we said, why not curate a proposition which A, uh, is easy for more and more people to access, um, is, um, is able to identify various solutions that people need in their journey uh, with cancer and is able to also help them maintain their digital records in a safe way so that they don't have to struggle with uh, multiple files of reports of uh, various other things that they will dabble with in their journey with cancer. That's how we kind of introduced Cancer Mitra. Uh, I have known about Grief Case ever since it kind of took shape uh, in the form of providing an, uh, an isolated platform that gives or enhances a patient's experience by providing digital records. In 2010, my mom got diagnosed with cancer. We followed through that journey where we went, walked through various uh, steps of her treatment. In 2016, lost her to cancer. That's when we said that we wanted to do something in the space of cancer to help patients uh, navigate through their journeys uh, in a very seamless way. Remember, even when we were walking through the journey with my mom, uh, there were piles and piles of files that we had to store and keep a record of in order to monitor her journey. Uh, at some point in time, we literally lost count and there were files that were missing, there were reports that were missing. Some of the reports were not kept in a chronological way. When we would go to meet the doctor, the first thing the doctor would have to do is uh, kind of make sure that all these files are kept properly or he would have to re-allocate uh, the files in order to truly understand where we were in, uh, in our process of treatment, uh, which would end up taking away at least 5 or 10 minutes of his time. Given uh, the fact that there are only 1400 oncologists in the country uh, and there are 15 lakh new cancer cases every year, uh, oncologists are very very tight on schedule and uh, this process of them having to figure the previous treatment protocol in order to move forward is very cumbersome for practitioners as well. But people don't face the issue of uh, having to travel from one city to another or one country to another simply to get an opinion. So that in itself is a huge uh, kind of uh, support that uh, digital tools, especially digital lockers can provide, especially with the government initiative of ABHA where they are trying to integrate uh, digital lockers with various healthcare initiatives. I feel it comes with a huge promise of uh, moving people to a truly enabled digital healthcare uh, ecosystem. Mm -hmm.